Hey you, I thought about you today. I thought about how time heals all wounds, clearly was written by man, one with limited knowledge and ability, one who clearly had never thought about you. I thought about how years and seconds could never be enough to make your longing less. They can only form the cross you must bear, the weight you must carry of time taken from your love of time you're left to endure alone up until time gives you up to glory I've spent time thinking of you and I thought you might want to know that I don't think it's fair not for your heart to break every day you wish for their presence not for your fingers to cripple as you thoughtlessly pick up the phone to give them a call. Not for you to carry Santa sacks full of love with no hope for delivery. No, I don't think it's fair for you to have a space in your body that aches perpetually. A pain you learn to live with because it won't go away as long as you live. But I also think that you're a walking miracle. I've heard you turn that pain into a song and I never knew I could listen to beauty. I watch heaven's light lead you into every space you enter. I blink and swear I see visions of you wrapped in angel wings. When you step into a room, God raises the ground to meet your feet, holding you upright, truly keeping you from falling, willing you to raise your head and move forward day after day. I thought about how his hands must be the hands that rock you, how his voice must be the voice that encourages you, and how when I see you, I know I must see him. And I do see you. I see you daring to live with memory as your comfort. I see you giving life a chance even when some days it hurts to move. And I see the you you don't always know how to be. The you that is anchored. Sturdy. Afloat. Light. Lifted. And whole. I want to encourage you. I want to tell you. You loved well, and that you're brave to love still. You can release the guilt or the anger or the sadness about being here without them. Just live with them planted in your belly, with their essence growing from your palms, their imprint like pollen all over your skin and leaving an unavoidable trail behind you. And I want you to know a secret. Love is the only thing that exists after death. It's okay for you to hold your love on this side because God told me your delivery day is coming. What you've held will not be lost. A doorstep in heaven waits in patience to receive it and to receive you. One day, you'll have a reunion that is so grand it will make you forget that you ever felt pain in their absence. You'll get there if you keep living. So please, keep living and know you are seen, you are heard, and you are worthy. Love, Nisha.